Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be a little bit different. It's not going to be a makeup tutorial. It's going to be a power of makeup video, which means I'm going to be applying makeup to one half of my face and leaving the other half as is, just so you can see side by side the difference that makeup can really make. So if you want to see how I do this, then please keep watching. I'm going to start off by priming my face and I'm using the Nivea Men Post Shave Balm. And I already know this is going to be so weird only doing half of my face, so I'm going to try really hard to not get carried away and do the other side. I'm also going to go in with some of the Benefit Pore Professional and just put that in the center right around here where I have a little bit larger pores. For foundation, I'm using the Makeup Forever HD Foundation Stick, and this is in the shade 120. already you can see the difference of just applying foundation. It really evens out my skin tone and covers up the large amount of acne that I have. So just that alone, you can already see a big difference. Then for concealer, I'm using the Urban Decay Naked Skin Weightless Complete Coverage Concealer and this is in the shade Light Neutral. And I'm just going to apply that basically in the center or half the center of my face. This is so weird. And then blend it out with my damp beauty blender. everything I'm using the Laura Mercier translucent powder For bronzer, I'm using the NYX Matte Bronzer in the shade Medium. blush I'm gonna be using this one right here it's an elf blush I don't know the name of it it's not on the back but it is just a matte pinky mauve blush and I'm just gonna go over that with a powder brush and kind of lighten it up a bit To highlight, I'm going to be taking this shade right here from the Carly Bible palette. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do my brows off camera, and I am just using the Anastasia Brow Wiz in the shade Medium Brown. Moving on to eyes, I'm going to be using the Carly Bible Palette, and I'm starting with this shade right here, just kind of a neutral flesh tone shade. 
and I'm just going to pop that into the crease. Then taking a smaller fluffy brush and this mauve shade right here, I'm going to put that into the crease as well. Then taking an even smaller fluffy brush and this dark plummy shade right here, I'm just going to put that in the outer V area. And then go back in with that medium fluffy brush and just kind of blend it in, kind of drag it into the crease a little bit. Then taking this matte cream shade right here, I'm just going to pop that under my brow for a bit of a highlight. Then taking this second shade here, it's kind of a shimmery champagne color, I'm just going to pack that onto my lid. flat definer brush and that dark plum color, I'm just going to press that up into my lower lashes, but I'm not going to take it all the way in, just about like halfway or so like that. Then taking a smudgy brush and that mauve shade, I'm just going to kind of go underneath that a little bit and blend it out. And I am going to bring this in a little bit further. Then I'm going to take this shade right here on a little dome brush and I'm just going to pop that on my inner tear duct. Then I'm just going to curl my lashes and apply some mascara. I'm using the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black. And then I'm going to apply some lashes off camera and I'm using the Ardell Demi Wispies. Moving on to lips, I'm going to be lining in this pencil from Jordana. It's in the shade Tawny. And for lipstick, I'm using the LA Girl Matte Flat Finish Pigment Gloss, and this one is in the shade Bazaar. Okay, so that completes this half makeup look. As you can see, it obviously makes quite the difference and it could be more or less of a difference depending on how subtle or dramatic you want to do it. It's just makeup. If you don't like it, you can wipe it off. It comes off at the end of the day anyways. So if you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye!